students at the center of a viral video controversy are not in school today. And the story continues to evolve with more people weighing in. Covington Catholic is closed today. The principal says that is because of safety concerns. And meanwhile, a peaceful vigil is being held across town. Conroy Delush is here in studio now with the LEX 18 Big Story today. At Chris and Dia, that video's first surfaced more than three days ago. Covington Catholic High School student Nick Sandman face to face with Native American Nathan Phillips. This morning, the American Indian Movement Chapter of Indiana, Kentucky was holding a peace rally and a peace vigil in Covington, saying they want to confront racism. Cars honked in support as demonstrators gathered in front of the Diocese of Covington. Their message this morning? confronting racism and to hold the administration, teachers and seemingly absent chaperones accountable in this situation. About two miles away, the school at the center of the video, Covington Catholic, is closed due to safety concerns. This all started on Friday after the March for Life in Washington. The teens insist that they faced a barrage of verbal abuse from a group who called themselves the Black Hebrew Israelites. That's when Native American elder and Vietnam veteran Nathan Phillips says he stepped in and began drumming as a gesture of peace. The teens are accused of mocking Phillips, something they deny, something they felt they were unfairly portrayed as villains in a situation where they say that they were not the instigators. Our boys were targeted. They were targeted from the get-go. Um, immediately, there were all these people running around filming. Governor Bevan did weigh in this morning on Twitter, writing in part, quote, in the third of three tweets, quote, in a world where we have a wealth of information at our fingertips, we have increasingly little discernment and wisdom. Facts matter. The truth matters. Context matters. A little more genuine caring for one another and a little less digital vitriol would be good for all, end quote. You can see his full statement on LEX18.com. Also, quick update, a Cincinnati media outlet is reporting that Nathan Phillips is agreeing to meet with Covington Catholic students, hoping to use what happened as a teachable moment. Back to you. All right.